www.networkingarizona.com. Welcome to Networking Arizona with host Carol Blonder. You'll hear interviews with businesses located throughout the valley. Networking, it makes a difference. If I traded it all. Welcome to the show, everyone. And some of you know, and some of you don't, because I just moved into this time slot, which is uh, the one o'clock right after Dan Bongioni, Dino. So that's kind of a cool thing right there. Um, I'm Carol Blonder, the host of Networking Arizona, and I created a show for everybody to come on and talk about themselves. And that is the coolest thing, because everybody likes to talk about themselves. We're live on Facebook, so I want to say hi to everybody out there. Like us and follow us. We're going to share the show later on, and I'm going to go in with my first guest. And I have with me Tony Geiger and she is the owner of Loving Hands Senior Transitions. Welcome back to the show. You know, before you even was this month, it was like last month that we talked, you say, Carol, I really want to come on a lot as much as I can in during the holidays, during November and December. And there was a reason for that. So first of all, I want you to talk a little bit about yourself, what you all do. I know you have a guest here. We're going to talk mm -hmm. about her in a minute, okay? But how you help people, listen up, folks, soup to nuts. Soup to nuts. <laughs> hey, so yeah, we're a full turnkey move management company for seniors only. So when a senior is downsizing into senior living, we do furniture placement, floor plan, interior design, pack, move, unpack, hang their pictures, switch cocks over to their new community, their estate sale, donations, clean the house and t turn that key over to the realtor. I'm telling you, it is the most awesome thing that you do. And the reason why, uh, first of all, thank you, because you are a senior's advocate, okay? You help people who are in a difficult time in their lives. Yes. Yes, there are people who are just downsizing who you can help as well, right? right? That's, you know, maybe 50 on up, whatever. But also, the fact that you really go to the furthest extent for each and every one of your clients. They are clients for life, right? Yes. And they are special to you. And I've seen things like, for instance, I have this. I don't know if I could put it up again. <laughs> Literally what they do in terms of moving somebody by measuring everything of where they're going before they even get there, which, of course, we should all do, but we never do it. Right. And, but you do it. Mm -hmm. And also for the fact that you make it so that you're taking what they have, you're getting them as downsized as possible, but to get into a place, into their place, Correct. that is going to be almost a mirror image of what they're really used to. Yeah, we want it, um, we don't want it to be like a brand new or they wouldn't know where anything is. We want it as familiar mm -hmm. as possible. So we take tons of pictures so we can mimic what they move into. So when they move in, they go into a new home, a new address, yes. But it's, it's a snapshot of their current home. If they like the change, you know, the TV changer on the right, that's where it is when they walk in the exactly. door. Exactly. Now, maybe it's you. Maybe it's someone that you know. Maybe you live out of state, you know, and you have a parent that lives here that is right. going through this time. We're going to be talking some interesting stuff here in just a little bit. Uh, but the main thing that you want to know about them is, first of all, they do free consultations. They work statewide. I have known that they will go out of state mm -hmm. to bring that person back or even move them the, yes. the, to another state. That's how far they go with everybody. Uh, also, I don't know if we're going to do this, but we are now. <laughs> everybody <laughs> that uh, calls in that is a vet. Is that you want to yes. still do that? Yes. We'll do it for right now, just because I said it. Uh, you're getting two hundred and fifty dollars off their services, and that's year round. So okay, so that's just something you do anyway. So yes. guess what? If you're a vet, you guess you get a little special pricing there, and uh, you could check them out on on Facebook, which is uh, a senior. Trans, loving Hand Senior Transition, and it's not with an S, so it's Loving Hand Senior Transition. Now, you can also call them. Their phone number is 602-583-9414. You know, if you need it, put it in the phone now. I know mm -hmm. a lot of people write things down, put it on the refrigerator, say, oh, yeah, I got to do that. Correct. Well, you know what? Do it. Write the number down and put it on your refrigerator and then do it. Make that call and help somebody transition so much easier into the next sort of life that they're going to be a lifestyle the that they've got. Their new chapter. Their new chapter. Now, you have somebody with you. Yes. Can you t tell us who you have I have you? Lori Sears. She, works, uh, she owns a placement uh, agency. Uh, she's a registered nurse, uh, works with dementia. So, yeah, it's ideal. I am so happy that you are here. I got to know you a little bit before the show. Okay. And I want you to tell everybody a little bit about 
you, how you got to be the owner, you know, of this assisted li living uh, locator, which we're going to talk about what that is, and w and how what makes you a uh, dementia specialist. Okay, so uh, hi, I'm Lori Sears, and I own Assisted Living Locators West Valley, and it is a franchise. We do have franchises all over the United States, and it's very fortunate for us that when we live in Arizona, we get a lot of people coming here from sta other states and sometimes moving back to where they came mm -hmm. from. Tony actually did help me with a client that needed to go to Colorado, and so she went above and beyond mm -hmm. with them. I can't even tell you... When I say soup to nuts, I mean soup <laughs> yeah. to nuts. She went That's another t-shirt. Totally <laughs> above and beyond than I could ever tell you what she did. It was mm -hmm. just phenomenal. And um, so the great thing about us is we are a free service. And we are free because we get contracts with communities and homes and they pay us a percentage. So that's how we get paid and can be free. But on another note is I still like to be a good resource. Whether you need my help or you don't need my help, I can give you people that can help you at the time that you're at in your life, whether it's non-medical or hospice or people like Tony, um, maybe even a mobile notary, whatever it might be, I usually have a resource for that. So I love to help people just because they don't know what to do. They have no idea how to even start the process. and. So what I generally do is have a good conversation with the family member or the client themselves that wants to move, figure out whether, where they're at with finances, budget, location, social needs, medical issues, all that good stuff, and try to find the right place for them. I am a registered nurse. I have been a registered nurse since 2006. My, um, this is my second career, and I was a, a fitness owner when I was raising my kids in Missouri and knew I needed to do something long term. So I went back at age 40 and got my nursing degree and worked for a local skilled nursing company. I did not know that they wanted me that to market as well, so I was a clinical liaison. And when I moved to Arizona 11 years ago, being a nurse who could market was apparently a hot commodity. So I worked out here in the world of skilled nursing and acute rehab and um, started working for, opened up two skilled nursing buildings, being on, the, on call all the time, I decided I wanted to be a, a, my owner again. So I researched assisted living locators and really liked what I heard. And so I bit the bullet and I haven't regretted one minute, one, one minute of it. I love working with seniors. They're awesome. They are, and it's a huge population here, obviously. Mm -hmm. I want to, real quickly, before we go to a break, what made you a, uh, you are a dementia care certified, you're certified in that, and why that was important for you to add that to what you already do. Well, it's <coughs> something that was um, brought to my attention by um, a gentleman named Brian Brown, who runs the Certified Dementia Education Program, and I just felt that it was important to know what's going on with people when they are work having dementia. There's 40 different kinds of dementia, and it's hard to know what you're dealing with. Well, we're going to go to a break, and when we come back, what I really want to do is we're going to uh, really dive deep into what it's like for seniors, which you both know so well, when they're going through this part of their life. And I've said this many times while you're on, people who are listening out of state, if you've got your family members here, they're the person to call. They're the perfect people that are going to give you resources, but help you live literally yes. from soup to nuts. They are not an estate salespeople. That's not what they are. They do so much more, and it's amazing what you do. And so the best thing to do is to call them and let them, and even if you think that you're around the corner, you don't even know, if you've got somebody that's a little bit older or and living with mm -hmm. you or near you or is part of your family, call them. Their phone number is 602-583-9414. I'm Peter Arona, licensed insurance agent. Social distancing doesn't keep me from going the distance for you. We are conducting Medicare plan reviews online, over the phone, and safely in person. It's that time of the year again. A thorough Medicare plan review is always a good idea to ensure your needs are being met. 
Contact me today to schedule your no-cost, no-obligation appointment at 602-770-9062, 602-770-9062, or at abcdmedicare.com. When someone close to you passes, the grief can feel overwhelming. So when it comes time to make the necessary preparations for your loved one, you can rely on Angel Cremation and Burial in Mesa. Our caring and professional staff knows you're going through a lot, so we focus on helping you understand your options. You only pay for what you truly need. To learn more about our many cremation and funeral services, call 480-962-6435. 480-962-6435. Angelscremationandburial.com. Knowing every client is different, Anna von Strassenberg, CPA, PLLC, prides herself by offering ethical, accurate, and professional guidance when it comes to accounting, tax, and consulting services like tax return preparation, tax projections, proactive tax planning, IRS representation, QuickBooks, Pro Advisors, and more. For more information or to schedule a free consultation, call 480-964-4030. That's 480-964-4030. Services available year-round, ArizonaCPAs.com. Hey, this is Howie. And me, Javi. Bravo Insurance Agency offers financial and lifestyle protection for those you love from an agency you can trust. Gain the financial lifestyle security you deserve. Proudly serving individuals, families, veterans, and America's small business community since 1985. For a free, no obligation consultation, call us at 480-316-7862. That's 480-316-7862. Like us on Facebook. Tired of paying high hourly fees when you need a plumber? With Cobra Plumbing, you get the same great service as the other guys, but to pay by the job, not the hour. So if you have a residential plumbing issue, don't wait. Call Cobra Plumbing today. Plus, our work is guaranteed. So call us today for your free estimate. Call 602-663-8432. That's 602-663-8432. To see a list of our complete service offerings, go to cobraplumbing.net. Dan Burke is a realtor in the Valley specializing in the lakes in Tempe. Nothing satisfies him more than watching his clients' dreams come true. For him, that's what being a real estate agent is all about. If you're a buyer looking for real estate opportunities in our communities, look no further. His website's free tools are all you need. Use his industry best property search to find the properties you love. As your representative, he will work tirelessly to help purchase or sell a property and will ensure the process is enjoyable and successful. You'll love living in the lakes. Call 602-369-1145 or visit him at thelakes.realestate. If I traded it all so welcome back, everyone. And we're right now talking with Tony Geiger, owner of Loving Hands Senior Transitions. She has with her Lori Sears. She's the owner and CEO of Assisted Living Locators. And, we, you know, what I love about my show the most, and I do love it, is that it's this great information for people out there. I say this all the time, and I surely mean it. Really, I do. Uh, we were talking at the break to Facebook land a little bit about how you got to where you are. And unfortunately, the time goes by so fast, so I'm just going to cut the, the, to the quick. One of the th- things that I said was that um, you, I asked you how it, how, what, what, ha- how, when does it start? When should someone call you? When do they know? And all of that. And basically, how I said it was, it starts with a story. And you said, yes, yes. Let's talk about a little bit about what that means, what it looks like. Somebody that has a parent, let's say, and of course, you don't have to be in dementia for this. But let's say somebody is dealing with that. What does that look like? How difficult is it? It's very difficult. I think for the most part, most of our parents don't want their kids telling them what to do. And But we know that they need some help. But they're being very stubborn and they want to keep their independence as long as possible. And quite honestly, that's what I do. I try very hard to keep them at home as long as possible. So when they call me and they say, I'm worried about mom. I don't know what to do. What Do you have any suggestions? I always go down the road of finding out what's going on with them. I try to do a really in-depth assessment, try to find about, out about their background, you know, what they enjoy doing. Are they still social? You know, how much care do they need? Do they need help with meals, etc.? So I try to find out what's happening with them so I know the right direction to start them. Sometimes they just need some in-home caregivers, you know, two or three times a week. It can keep them in their home a lot longer. And 
you know, we don't want to tell our parents what to do, but... Oh, yeah, we do. <laughs> <laughs> but, and they don't want to listen to what we have to say. And I have a 92-year-old dad. I know how that is. He's very stubborn, and he is determined to stay in his home until he dies. Right. They, most of them do. You know, they worked hard for that. Yes. And people are living longer. It's a little different now. We've got we've got our stuff even more. You know, that's our, that's our little caves. Those are our places that we live, that we built, and all of that. And it's hard. It's hard once you start seeing them even if it's just losing their keys they're getting calls now um you know th- their keys that they and they have to give the keys because they can't drive right. anymore but the reason why i want to come back full circle here for a second is that tony brought you here for not only to be able to educate the public a little bit but another reason is because these are the people that tony works with this is what makes them full circle here this is what makes them soup to nuts if you have somebody that is in an issue where you don't know where to go. You can't just look in the yellow pages for something like this. This is a little bit more intricate than that. This is where when you call someone like Tony, who is the owner of uh, Loving Hand Senior uh, Transitions, it's not about just moving them. Also, it's about finding that place as well. So mm-hmm. it starts again with that story. You find out what their needs are, what they're looking for. Then you have people. You're a resource to people. Mm-hmm. And then, of course, you are as well. It just keeps on going and going. And when you are in the situation of having an older parent to deal with that, boy, do you need all the help that you can get. Their phone number to call is 602 583 sorry nine. 414. They do free consultations. They work statewide and they move you completely. And when we mean completely, we mean it from soup to nuts. Now, I want to go back to you, back to Lori. Lori, when someone is going through something like, let's say, just changing, they needed now, you said that you had somebody that was living in, um, uh, they were more able to live on their own and now they're not. What happens to somebody? What's it like working with them are they cantankerous are they what are they are they gonna, are they open to it what's it like i have the whole gamut they are usually in denial or mad they don't want to move um, kids are trying to suggest them to try to move i think sometimes it just takes that additional fall that maybe causes them to go into the hospital that the doctor then says mom can't go home alone she has got to have care 24 7 that's when many times they call me i can do fast searches i can find people options very very quickly um it's it's just a matter of knowing what their what they need their care the budget and what their um, social aspect is because some of them are still very social and we don't want to lose that right Um, but uh, it like we said before it starts with a story and if you are it doesn't matter where you are because you help people nationwide I mean, you statewide statewide mm-hmm. but also out of state because you will go and help whoever basically you will help anyone that calls you yes. practically if you could do what, what they are looking for or what their needs are you basically will help them you're going to find out about what their story is you're going to try and find them in any way you can yes when you move them you know now that they are already kind of upset because i'm sure there's stages just like in dying this is a death too to people that are, have been in their homes for a long time, and now they they know it. They know that they're deteriorating, and that's got to be really scary. Yes, it is. It is. Um, I think the hardest thing for all of us as we age to see the things we were able to do really easily now is sometimes not as easy. Well, think about it. I mean, I'm 63, and when I just see what I look like, it makes it difficult, right? You know, just those little things. But you know it starts around then when you all of a sudden you walked in the room and it's like, well, what did I come in here for, <laughs> right? And I have to write notes everywhere. People think I'm nuts, but if I didn't have the notes, I'd be a, I'd be a derelict because I wouldn't remember anything. And I'm sure a lot of people out there listening right now can relate to that. Think about what that feels like sometimes when you are even just in 50 or 60 and you feel old. Now you're 70 or 80. It's quite, it's even scarier. It's really scary. It is, especially when their their strength starts declining and they need a walker and then they need a wheelchair and then they need help getting in and out of bed all of those are things that 
create a lot of fall risk, makes them unsafe at home, and but they still want to hang on to that last shred of independence. So going back now to uh, Tony and that what you know, having them needing to have to be moved now, they needed mm -hmm. to find that place. Um, but then Tony comes in. You're going to have that consultation with them. You sit and talk to them. What are your needs? Let's right. talk a little bit about that. Well, not only what their needs are, but what's their history? What's, what's their story? Because we want as much of them involved as possible. We want that their new apartment as much of them as possible. Which is so awesome when right. you think about that, to do that. And let me say this to you folks. <laughs> Don't try and do it yourself. You know, a lot of people, well, I can do that. Of course you <laughs> could think you can do that. But it's way different when you have somebody who does it for you, number one. Right. Who wants to do all the packing anyway, right? You know, really on top of that, I'm telling you, I'm hiring you just when I downsize because <laughs> I don't want to do it. But the other thing is, is that it's, it's that you're still their child. You're still the child. And it's very difficult to try and do something like this on your own with them because they don't want to know they don't want you telling them what to do well not only that but when we get involved and there's the kids aspect and the parent aspect the parents oftentimes are mad at the kids and they're like it's angry. their fault and like you're right exactly so when we come involved we take all the blunt and we're like we're the bad guys but we turn it to we're not the bad guys because we're working for them and i always make sure to, to let the seniors know hey this is all about you it's not about us it's all it's not about your kids it's all about you and when i say soup to nuts i mean that because you will build cabinets within like let's say they have a closet do you really need that little closet there for one coat? Not really. Not really. Guess what? Now we just made that into a pantry. And you do that. Yes. That's amazing. I love that that you do that about that. You take the measurements of the entire place mm -hmm. so that we know, does that couch fit in there or not? Okay? Right. Because then if it doesn't, then I guarantee you, you're out shopping with them and picking one that does. I'm just saying. I don't know. And right now, you, you cannot go out shopping for furniture because you will not get it for another six months. Really? So you see, that's why, but there you go. You will even help them. But you know what else you do, which I think is also really neat too, is when somebody has something that they really want, like we, we talked a little bit about earlier, uh, uh, the last time you won, which is a wedding gown. Now, you don't really need that again, right? right? I know it has memories, but you make it, in, if you want to maybe make it into a pillow, make using the fabric. You do so many things. Yeah, yeah. So if you have a favorite item that you just do not want to get rid of, we we connected with a lady that she'll make quilts, she'll make wedding uh, purses, she'll, she'll recreate those items for you. I think you. that's really neat. You have a loved one, make them into a purse, you know, that's an awesome thing. You carry them around wherever you go. <laughs> that's right. And again, back to you, we have less than a minute. So you're a free service. Do you help people uh, nationwide or how does that work? Yes, nationwide. So there are other people like me that are in other states. So when I find out what area you guys are looking to move mom back to, I connect with my person who does what I do and I and they can help you from a distance try to find options and move them right into your community well i'll tell you that's what we talk about soup to nuts that is what uh loving hand senior transitions is you can check them out on facebook at uh loving hand senior transition without the s and but also call them have that consultation with them it starts with a story our families are all coming in town yes. this is the time to do it 602-583-9414 Destination Arizona Conference Planners is changing the way meetings are implemented.